The killing of an assistant commissioner of police, Aminu Umar, by terrorists in Katsina State has left many residents terrified as they mourn the brave police officer who is said to have previously rescued several communities under the grip of bandits. A rice correspondent in Katsina State, Awal Ibrahim, reports. Katsina residents, especially those in Dus Amma town, are mourning the killing of a brave and gallant police officer. Amin Umar, who got killed by terrorists during a fierce gun duel. Until his death, a day he was an assistant commissioner of police and the area commander of Duzama. He is said to have led a police team to Kofi area of the state, where they killed one of the bandits' commandant on Monday. Angered by the death of the terrorist leader, the terrorists turned out en masse on Tuesday and led an ambush where they exerted revenge for the killing of their master during a police clearance operation in the Zakka forest within Safana local government area of Kazum State. The courageous police officer is said to have been called several times by many local leaders for support whenever the bandits are attacking their communities where he often turn up to dislodge them. With the killing of the police commander, residents of some localities like Duzama, Bazari, Damusa, Kankara, Kurfi and Safana now live in fear amidst a state of hopelessness as the terrorists continue to advance towards the areas. A local leader who is the district head of Duzama says the late area commander Amin Umar was always ready to respond to distress calls. Police officer, he's always up and doing, he's always ready to assist the people. In times of distress, if you call him, he will respond. He's one of the first responders to emergencies in this area. Uh, and as you are aware, he died in the line of duty. He went to assist, he was aware that the band, these bandits were on their way to Safana and Buzema, and he tried to intercept them. But as God will have it, he lost his life along the way. It's a very great loss, very, very great loss. Chairman of the Kazuna State Coalition of Civil Societies Organization, Abdurrahman Abdullah, says, the late ACP Amin Umar was an officer who was passionate about his job, but unfortunately paid the supreme price. So he is such an officer that uh, has you know, fashion for his job. He is such an officer that is always ready to respond to call whenever the call is put to him. Let me tell you one thing about him. Sometimes you don't even wait for call to be made for him to take action. He will be calling, especially uh, this... Uh, uh, red zones to find out what is the security situation there because he has people almost he had people almost everywhere that he relate to to find out from them even before calling him what is your situation is there any uh, strange movement you are seeing is there anything that uh, needs security attention so this was a uh, 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 SCP uh, Aminu spokesman of the Kazan State Police Command Gamba Isa while elegizing the brave police officer, says the command has lost a gallant officer who was very instrumental in the fight against terrorists, especially in the frontline local government areas. Uh, they were wearing this uh, long uh, black uh, uh, captain uh, with turban. Uh, they were sh uh, shooting at them with AK-47 rifles and uh, uh, general purpose machine guns, uh, shouting Allahu Akbar. Uh, that was really what happened. Uh, the area commander is a gallant officer. He's a very seasoned, experienced police officer. Uh, immediately he discovered that uh, uh, this is uh, a terrorist attack, uh, not the usual uh, Pulani bandit that he used to engage with. Uh, he immediately uh, called for the withdrawal of his men. And uh, uh, by this uh, sing singular action, the area commander uh, is selfless because uh, many of his men will have died uh, in the attack uh, but he asked them to go and uh, he remained uh, with one other lieutenant his uh, officer uh, that is second to him in that place an ASP uh, who also gallantly lost his life this is the second time that the Kazan State Police Command is losing a brave officer to terrorist attacks after the date of the divisional police officer in charge of GBR local government area in early February this year. Awal Ibrahim, Arise News, Kasana.